for the last 10 years, we've worked with their business to business sales department. Last year, for the very first time, I had the chance to um, work with their direct sales team down in uh, Texas. So 150 different salespeople, and guys, you want to talk about a hard job? These are the individuals who go knocking door to door to sell cable, high-speed data, video, and phone service. That is a tough, tough job. I'm down there at their sales summit last year, and a gentleman by the name of Larry comes up to me at one of the breaks. Guys, here's what he says to me. He says, Dirk, you've got me thinking, man. And you know what I'm thinking? I've been doing this direct sales for the last 28 years. And what do you think he was wondering, you guys? What? Why? He started, he started asking himself, why have I been doing this? And he took it a step further because he didn't know his why. He started questioning if he had what? If he had wasted the last 28 years of his life because he didn't know the why. I sat down and I talked to him. We started talking. I started probing. I started questioning. I, and, and you know what I found out? What I found out was that, man, Larry brought families together. Larry didn't sell cable. You know what he did? He brought families together that couldn't find the time to get together unless they were around the TV. He brought families together. You know what he found out in talking to him? He, I found out in talking to Larry that he helped small businesses succeed and grow with their high-speed data and their digital phone systems. He and I got to talk, and he says, you know what, Dirk, you're right. He says, there must be a why other than just selling appliances or cable services. What is your why? I asked him for free HBO after that, and I lost him. But 